Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about different mechanical design companies. So there's lots of different companies out there that do mechanical design work. Pretty much any mechanical engineer can do mechanical design, right? So you have a great product idea and you're trying to get this product all the way from conceptualization through to manufacturing and actually selling it and being successful. So what do you need? You need to find someone that can help you take that product idea out of your head and make it a reality. So the first person you're going to work with is a product designer. They're the one that's going to actually do the sketching of your product. They're going to go out into the marketplace and do the market research, do your patent research, and see where there's a niche in the marketplace that can be filled with your product. So I'm just going to give you an example here for where our product, it's a smartphone video mount. There's tons of mounts out there that allow your smartphone to be run in GPS, like in your car, right? None of them allow you to actually film from your car dashboard, right? So this does a lot more than that, but that's just one example. So we found that the niche for us was point of view action cameras with the HD camera you already had in your pocket. So then we had to go through, we went through, picked out the concept sketches we liked best, pick and chose from the different concept sketches, and came up with some really good ideas. The first revisions of our product, we had a bolt that you literally have to screw in and unscrew and screw in and unscrew between every one of the mounts. Well, one of the product designers came up with this cool contraption, which is just a quick release buckle. I can source this off the market. Uh, it's interchangeable with GoPro, and it just clips in and out of all the different mounts we make. Something we would have overlooked had we not gone to a product designer. Then you gotta go into the engineering. So for us, it was all mechanical engineering, because the product is very mechanical, and there's no, no uh, electronic parts or moving parts other than the mechanical pieces. So the product is totally universal. It fits any phone on the market. So you open it up, stick your phone in, tighten it up. Now your phone's totally secure. So you have to make sure that someone's $800 cell phone isn't going to go bouncing down the mountain when they're going mountain biking or something. Next, you got to be able to adjust the angle. So we have 180 degrees of adjustability, which is important if I'm filming from my chest, the front of my helmet versus the top of my helmet. So lots of different reasons we had to go to mechanical engineers. Um, our mechanical engineer that we used was Focus Product Design. So if you want more information on their form of mechanical engineering, um, what's interesting is they have everyone under one roof. So your product designer is talking to your engineer. Your engineer has experience uh, engineering for manufacturing. So you're going to go into manufacturing ready to go. You don't have to do all the different tooling changes and different tests and trying to source different products. They already have that experience. They know what parts they can get the cheapest and what you should be using. So I highly suggest going with a mechanical engineer that has all those capabilities. So really you're gonna have to find a product design firm that does everything for you, which is the product design, manufacturing, and the uh, engineering work. So if you want more information, I'll post a link to Focus Product Design right here below this video. Run out there and check them out, guys. Thanks for watching.